Yo, the geeks, it's Les Mine here, and welcome back to more golf. Goodbye, Volcano Hot. Um, I'm wearing the wrong headset because I was testing out my mic. But we're going to continue with it. I am going to be playing. I am going to record two videos today, which is going to be Princess Peach right after this. Uh, I spent, I wasted 30 minutes trying to get this mic set up. And I really hope it stays like this for a bit. <laughs> okay, I think we stopped where they was going to the place. Okay. You begin to see mangroves as you approach the swamp from above. Huge roots reaching down into the water. A deep, choking mist forming near the canopy. At first, I think it's I chose just the a other thing instead of swamp. Standing alone amidst the brackish water. But as you continue, the trees get larger, blocking out the sun, and the swamp air gets thicker, warmer, and wet. Wow. All right, let's speed run this. So basically the locker room at the PE. Exactly. Uh -huh. Your visibility starts to get worse as the mist thickens. You can barely see the huge web of roots that lies beneath. In the distance, you catch a glimpse of one huge mangrove rising far above these still giant trees. As you strain your eyes to see, suddenly the airship lurches to the side. The vagrant is snagged in the branches. Oh, it's too dangerous. You're going to have to jump before the ship caps. See, si capsizes? The airship capsizes? I can't risk it. Jump. What do we do? Do we jump? I jump. I'm jumping. Okay, I jump too. Jumping. Uh, I jump. I, I never play these type of LARP or what's it called? D&D &D or something like that. Never. I can never get into these. Oh, I cast reach your vice as we Okay, fall. you can only target three creatures. Okay, well, since we jumped first, I guess I have to leave out Faye and Ollie. Sorry, guys. Fine, spring from your hands and surround Jeff, you, and Linnea. Then reach out and wrap around the branches of the mangrove, slowing your descent. Making sure everything's recorded. I hate... I don't know, it's my pet peeve when stuff don't record. Ollie and Faye, you both tumble off the ship. I don't hitting know why I'm talking about branches this to you guys. before landing on top of one of the giant mangrove roots. You both take six damage. That's a lot. Okay, that's not too bad. Are you sure? What's what's your hill? Nice landing. Ten out of ten. Hang on. I think if we get the vagrant unstuck. You can go in all search of the axe. I'll meet up with you afterwards. Goodbye. Yeah, see you later, Virgin. Okay, so Reed, where are we? Right. You've all landed together now, and as the patch of mist clears away, you realize you have landed smack dab in the middle of a group of mushroom people. What? Oh, the mushroom folks are the worst. Their pale, fleshy faces turn to stare at you. They screech and raise the weapons they were honing before you interrupted them. Roll for initiative. Oh, I hate mushrooms. I don't like mushrooms. I don't like mushrooms at all. I remember my old house, like, mushrooms was growing outside of our yard. I was, like, so scared. <laughs> I thought it was an apocalypse because, like, I don't know. I just don't like how mushroom looks like. 18, not bad. I got a 20. These mushrooms are pretty slow, so they're going to go last. I played some stick chords on the guitar to blast them with the wave of sound. Seven damage to each of them. They actually really don't oh. like that. A bunch of them run and flee, and a few melt into puddles of spores. Ow. Okay, you next, Faye. I'll cast an area of effect spell too. Dark flames, uh, dark flames interrupt the from the floor in a twenty foot circle around targets. Five fire damage. Did you know they were too weak to fire? Really, I just wanted to set them on fire. You burn the rest of the mushroom people into charred little stumps. You burn the rest of the mushrooms people into charred little stumps. Barbecue. Nice. I didn't even have to get involved. Couldn't stand to hurt any plants, huh, Mia? What? Mushrooms are our plants. They're fungi. Oh. Anyway, after you defeat the mushrooms, you begin to feel a sense of dread. Can we roll the bodies? Do, do, do those mushrooms have any loot? Mm, it's very strange. Their bodies sink in the mud, and you can't find anything. Ah oh, man, now I definitely feel a sense of dread. Okay, do we want to head to the giant tree? Is that our goal? I mean, he wouldn't just put one giant tree in the middle if he didn't want us to go there, right? 
Our characters don't know that. Do I sense of which direction it is? Yes. As a vine mage, you feel an acute sense of dread coming from one direction in particular. Guys, I'm beginning to feel a little acute feeling of a dread coming from one of our direction of protection. You begin moving through the swamp in that direction. It's difficult. The water reaches up to your thighs. Small gnats Whoa. begin swarming around you, biting at your faces, crawling near your nose holes. Oh, yeah. Each footstep becomes more and more difficult as the mud under the water sucks on your feet. Can I just imagine the mud is Kef? Yes. Actually, <laughs> you can. You start thinking of Kef. You clearly picture his face lit by candlelight. I knew he was a romantic. And as you're looking deep in his eyes, glittering in the firelight, you get the sense that something is very, very wrong. And Maya, you turn around, and you see the forest you grew up in as a little girl, and the flicker isn't a candle. It's a line of orange that fills the entire horizon. That's when you smell smoke. Oh no! Flames rush through the underbrush. How long is this D and D? So fast, so remarkably fast. You can barely hear the screams of your family over the roar, and you know intuitively that no water, no fine magic, nothing will save the forest. It is lost. Do the rest of us see this? You do not see this, Linnea. You see a wall. A wall? Yes. On this wall, there's a pattern. It's so intricate. Lines swirling and collapsing in on themselves. It's so intricate that your eyes have a hard time focusing on it. And yet, the pattern just makes sense to you. You're right on the verge of cracking it. You walk closer, and the pattern begins to converge. And you feel yourself falling. Words lose meaning. You forget how to speak. There's just these lines everywhere. If you can just figure it out, you forget who you are. You forget time. You only see this pattern. This is awful. All right, I'm just adjust. I'm just adjusting my setup while recording this. I apologize, you guys. I am so sorry. Jeff. Oh no. Jeff, you feel great. I do. I mean. Great, I do. You're surrounded by gold. Everywhere you look. Gold, gems, trinkets. You're on a huge mountain of gold. Sweet. Can I swim in the gold? You sure can. You play in this vast sea of wealth. But then, things get boring. You've already tried sliding, swimming, building gold stacks. All of it. The thing is, the more you walk around, the more gold you see. But you never see another person. Not another living thing. You're utterly alone. I know, please don't try to make me learn a lesson from this. Ollie, you see Braxis. I punch him. You punch him. He smiles at you. You try to attack him again and again. And he is completely unfazed. Then, with one flick of his finger, you are vaulted aside. You know you've lost. You know that evil will return to the land. And the thing is, life isn't so different under Braxis. You return home, and the day-to-day -day is very similar to your life before you went adventuring. Except for one thing. Every day, every time you step out of your tiny home into the bright sun, you see something in the faces of everyone around you. You hear the whispers behind your back. You see the masked smiles. All hiding disappointment. I, uh, wow, sorry to everyone, I guess. Faye. Faye, you see yourself. Myself? Yes, you are watching yourself. You see yourself return home. You see yourself interact with people you used to care about. You see yourself do things that you used to enjoy doing. But you, you feel nothing. You are a ghost. Watching Faye talk. Watching Faye move. Watching Faye sleep. 
But keep staring at your fey face for some piece of recognition of what it is you should feel or do or are. But it's always just out of reach. Can I talk to anyone? You've long stopped trying to scream at the people Faye talks to. But tonight, you try screaming at Faye. To try and understand what has happened. To understand who Faye is. To try and feel... something. But Faye never hears. Never reveals anything. Faye just... is. That pretty hurts. That, that, that hurts. They're great. Twist the knife, why don't you? As these terrible visions fill you all with overwhelming doom, you suddenly realize you're all waist deep in the mud and you're sinking fast. Shoot, uh, let me look through my spells. I got it. I got a cast. I got a clasp and tendril and direct the vine to warp around a tree trunk before extending over to us. You're a lifesaver. Quick, everyone, use the vine as a rope and pull yourself towards the edge of the mud. You don't need to tell me twice. After escaping, you finally approach the blight tree. This better be the it. The sounds of the swamp, crickets, frogs, the wind even, have all stopped. Oh, this close, you can't even tilt your head back enough to see the top. Thick, dark saps erupts from the punk marks all over the surface of the tree. Oh hey, it's sophomore year again, yeah. Yeah, but your skills are flawless now, don't even think about it. You begin to feel, once again, the sense of overwhelming. I rushed the tree. Okay, you rushed the tree. Is he supposed to talk here? Cause usually read, like, he actually narrate his lines, but I guess not. There's no way I'm letting this stupid tree get the better of me again. I'm the plant mama, me. You scream, I'm the plant mama, as you That's... race forward, brandishing your staff as you near the roots of the epic mangrove. What are the rest of you doing? I'm waiting and seeing. I'll get a little closer, I guess. I just wanted to smite this thing. Let's go. As you connect with the root, it feels fleshy. Your staff embeds inside one of the oozing pockmarks. And then, with a yank, you are pulled inside. Mia! Oh no! Huh? Oh, thank goodness it's over. <gasps> what? Tell me, tell me, tell me! Is something happening to your character? I'll never tell. Ooh, secrets! I love secrets. Is she gonna transform? Oh, shush. No one has any secrets. Agreed. No secrets. Oh my gosh, we're still on. Anyways, you all have something else to worry about. I'm going to need all of you to. Prepare for battle. All right. I guess after this boss battle, I'm gonna be saying I'm tired of reading. But if when I play Dreamlight Valley again, I'm gonna mostly be reading that throughout that whole game. Oops, not so great. Linnea, you're first. Then Jeff. Then Faye. I'm coming, Mia. I rush forward to put my hands on a tree, casting banishment. Roll for effectiveness. A15. Normally pretty good, but against this guy doesn't do anything. It whips out at you with a root, sending you flying back. I use one of my throwing spoons and I heard at the tree. How good is your aim? Eagle eye. Oh, well, in that case, it sails through the air and embeds itself in the tree's trunk, where black ooze starts dripping out. I made it bleed. I can't use any of my big spells. They hurt Mia, too. Attack my roots. Attack branches. Um... Is she on the... Let's attack the roots. Might as well do it either way. She's gonna lose some damage. Ooh. I go for the roots. We're not too close to Mia's body. Roll for me. 13. You sever some of the roots, which wriggle away on the ground like worms. More black sap starts oozing out from its wounds. Oh, this thing is a pain. You guys have done a good bit of damage so far. It's the tree's turn now, and instead of attacking you, it plunges some of its free roots down into the muck. You hear a gross sucking sound, and the wounds you've given the tree start to regenerate. Jeff, your spoon pops out of the tree with its bark healed over. Faye, the cuts you've managed to inflict also seal back up. That's 25 damage it healed itself for. I don't understand why this isn't working. There has to be a way to do this. 
is a mangrove resistant to everything? I don't remember seeing anything in the creature pavilion about this. Um, I want to do something. Can I do something like cast a spell? You can try. What spell do you want to cast? Uh, what about this? I cast Psychic Lambasting. What's that? It says here I can tap into the mind of and taught any set of creatures I choose within a 60 meter radius. Are the mangroves here? Oh, they sure are. Faye, you reach out, sliding into the collective consciousness of the swamp. What do you say? Make it good. Oh gosh, I don't know. Maybe this should be a group dis discussion? Hey, three idiots! Your mother has sappy prosmic bark. Yeah, and your roots are so gnarly, gnarled, they make me want to yard. Normally, I wouldn't stand for this slender, but it's appropriate. These trees suck. I hate them, and they should feel bad. Wow. Brutal. Crushing. All the trees at once shudder as if flinching. They're stunned for a moment. Oh gosh, I try to break free. As you begin to emerge, you feel the mangrove sucking you back. You get the sense that you don't have much time. I attacked the spot when Mia was poking out. Okay, that's a three, a seven, an eight, and a one. Um, uh... Ah, uh, hurry! I'm doing my best. It's 18. Right. Actually, Why didn't you say 18? 18. Uh, 23 if you factor in the bonus. And okay. that's a high enough roll. Ollie, you weaken the tree enough for Maya to break free. I'm back, baby. Time to kick some trunk. Maya, suddenly you feel great. Any lingering dread is gone. And you're ready to mess this nasty tree up. I rush back to my feet, take a few steps back, and then turn to face this horrible, horrible abomination of a plant. Maya, you feel a deep emerald power minutes. coursing through your viney veins. Where the tree was trying to suck you in before, it reels and shrinks away from your newfound glorious energy. How do you want to finish this? End this off, Maya, please. I'll take my staff, wind up, and gather all my energy from the flower mother, smash into the ground. Do you say anything? Oh, help me. What do I say? Something badass, something funny, something badass. Something about flower power? Suck my flower power. As oh you God. smash your staff into the swamp, nothing happens. Wow, then, after a moment, a streak of blinding light bursts from the water all around you. The water instantly evaporates. And as the circle of light shoots upward, you see the tree pus and decay get blasted off, leaving healthy bark beneath. The mist has been burned away, and as the sun shines down for the first time, you see in the grotto of the tree, Blightbane, the axe of oh. legend. I'm going to gently reach into the grotto and ease out the axe. Oh my. Oh, she about to upgrade? The transform. You pull it out. Whoa, that sounds pretty crazy. Oh, she upgraded. Shook a lot better. Oh my gosh. Cool axe, Mia. Where is it at? Thanks, it's awesome. It feels very god killy. Oh, wait. Does it read? It totally feels god killy. But you get the feeling it isn't meant for you. Oh, oh, right here, Faye. You can have this. Oh, thanks. Nice sex, Faye. Yes, we did it. I think that was the hardest combat we ever had. We almost lost you, Mia. What were you thinking running in there by yourself? You could have been killed, leaving the rush to me. Hey, the important thing is that we made it and I didn't die. And... The rest of you notice that the beam of sunlight reflects off of Maya's hair in new and exciting ways. I cast time slow and flip my hair. It looks incredible. It's like a shampoo commercial. There's like a soft glow everywhere. It's fantastic. Bro, a shadow passes I, I over you saying, all. I gotta you stop look saying, up bro. to see the silhouette of the vagrant. As a rope ladder gets unfurled, you hear Sid call down from above. I don't know why I'm saying bro so much. I don't know who is saying bro, or maybe I keep using that sound effect every time my videos. I need to stop saying it. It's annoying. Hey, you guys didn't die. Oh, that. Elena, let's get out of this. Okay, finally, I got to kill you. You all return to the ship and tell Celeste what happened. Does she notice my hair? Me, I love the hair. You're glowing. Thank you for all the hard work. I know I've been dangerous. I must have been. Me almost got swelled by a tree. 
You also managed to avoid the true danger of the mist demon grows being lost in your fears forever. Do you think you might have, I don't know, lead with that? Yeah, that was super creepy. See, now I'm starting to doubt your credentials, Castell. Yeah, we specifically asked you about that, Castell. Yeah, Castell, I'm going to my room. I literally don't know how I could have been more clear. Then you all retire to your quarters and turn in. But Faye, you spend some time struggling to fall asleep. And when you finally do, you're suddenly awoken by a light in your eyes. What? You open them. Does this someone have a torch? still going. No, it's coming from outside. You open the door to the deck and step out. You hear it before you see it. A slow whine. A whisper coming from this light in the sky. You hear something coming. A whisper tickling at the base of your spine. A single word. Cataclysm. Something zips onto the deck beside you. It's a small piece of hail. Sizzling. Then zip, zip, zip. More start coming down around you. Then come the screams. The burning hail rains down, tearing through the ship. Everyone is panicking. Running. It's chaos. You see Sid and Celeste turn and run full speed off the deck, holding hands as they fall. The light winks out. For an eternity, everything is quiet. Then on the horizon, you see the sunrise. Rays of crimson light crawl across the sky. The whole sky is a dazzling red. It's so peaceful. But your gut knows better. This isn't sunlight. Sunlight doesn't smell like ash. The sky is on fire. You hear the roar now. And your world explodes in pain. The sound is deafening. It's so hot. So inescapably hot. Why won't it just end? And you wake up. What? In your bed, on the ship. You glance over at the mirror, but you don't see Faye. You see a shadow. A shadow with a burning red smile that whispers, Hello, Faye. Miss me. Oh. Just got dark real quick. And that is where we will end tonight's session. That was 30 minutes, dude. Um, that was really Oof. dark. Bree, dude, what the heck was that last bit? Yeah, that vision you gave Faye was ominous. Things are reaching their conclusion. Yeah, it's basically what's up. happening in real life. Like, a meteor or an asteroid, something about to fall on us. That was pretty dark. Pretty hey, dark. Trish, can we talk? Sure, but it, it's kind of late though. Gotta go feed Mango. Sage, walk me home, my cook with the left hook. We'll talk later. Battle of the Bands is gonna be epic. See ya. Yes, your last one. It's kind of messed up. Should have talked before we. Just, just trying to avoid me. I wonder how Good the evening. battle could be. Like. Our top story tonight: the latest on the asteroid scientists are predicting will make a close path to the planet. Good. Officials continue to say what? there is little danger posed by this once-in-a-generation astrological event, with most projections showing the space rock missing impact by a margin of 20 to 30 percent. But one local amateur astronomer is raising alarm with new self-published trajectories that show a much higher chance of impact from this massive object. Faye trying to go to school? College? I 
I downloaded the whole uh, soundtrack of this song because I made this whole game because it's so good. Like, I haven't heard this one though. It's so good. It's so good. First national speech and debate. Oh, snap. I can't wait to play this other game for you guys. It's called We Are Over LFK. I was going to play it on my main channel, but I didn't know that that was not the game I was excited for. I was excited for this one. Oh! So, we're going to play that right after we finish Goodbye Bukina High. And it's almost like this, but it's with, not with dinosaurs, it's with actual humans. And it's like a whole band. Uh band living in LA and all that it's just I can't wait to play that I played it one time but I'll play it again for y'all Texting us. <gasps> y'all see the oh? Did y'all see the the um action figures on my side? Wow, that's a is this the end of this episode or something? When they do stuff like that, reminds me life is strange. Oh, the future freaks me out. Episode four. How many episodes are there? There's eight episodes, y'all. I don't even know how long is each episode. So now we know that Naomi is the one that's taking it's funny. fake. It's not the day of a big thing that Y'all makes you the, nervous. The outfit it's that the day before. <sighs> Naomi is drawing. Head. And we saw how it looked. Wow. How are you doing? Can I help you? This is awkward. How are you doing? Like, that's my bro. How's it going with you? It's going. You? Blah. BOTB tomorrow? Right? Yes. I thought oh, it was today. God. Yeah. I remember because, well... I could draw your poster from memory. I saw so many of them when I uh, collected them from school. So effective marketing. Huh. Funny. You didn't have anyway, to do that. Sorry for like, being annoyed. He could have just left. How's it. the show prep going? Yeah. Mm. He could have just left. We it are school. as ready as we'll ever be. I guess. I just keep thinking of everything that could go wrong. Like breaking a guitar string. Well, I wasn't until you said that. No, I mean, like, the part where we have to get in front of a bunch of people and not suck. Oh. And what if you do? I'd probably die. I get like this sometimes. I think everybody does. I got an idea. We do this sometimes in drama to work out stage fright. I am not doing a trust fall. No, not that. Just focus on your breathing. Please picture everyone naked. Now, put your hands on your hips like your Captain Triassic. Okay, never mind. I don't know what. Come on, a real power stance like this. Okay, that's a that's a motivation, confident type stance. Feet Are apart, we... really grounded. Okay, hands nice. on hips. Put your back into it this time. Head up, like the whole world. I can't breath, hold all that. And wings out. You're winning this thing. Yeah, that was very impossible. Well, actually, it's not. Now. I should have. <laughs> you won. Why did you win? I gotta I play guess. this every day. Well, we work well together. We have fun. Our songs are great. We have fun. Playing together is kind of amazing. And people can tell we're having a good time. Hey, as long as we're having fun, thanks. Sorry about the other day. Let's say sorry about the other day. Let's say it. Say. I'm sorry for blowing up at you the other day. I was being kind of a dick. Kind I of? really do appreciate you, little bro. I know. Little bro. We're family. Faye's older. Whether okay. you like it or not. So, I'm here to help. 
Why well, I thought he was older? Or is Faye just saying that? Just the. I thought he was older. Boop. Hey, you leave yet? Want to walk together? Sure. Let's hope it's. Yep. Let's hope it's not weird. Let's please walk together and talk about. You know, just talk. I don't want to lose Trish, even though Trish wants to do the little bug <sighs> university okay. mess. She's my best friend. She's okay. We've talked about stuff best before. friend. Oh, is this LA? And I know what I want to say. I just have to actually say it. Listen, Listen Trish. Florida. <laughs> oh, okay. I feel hurt. I want to support you. Um, you want to support, but. You feel her fate, but I, I want to say that. I don't want to force you to stay with the band. I want you to do what's important for you always. I want to share this. I'll miss you. You're gonna, Faye's going to miss Trish, of course. I know this isn't the end, but it would be different without you there for a while. Anyway, I'm sorry I got weird. You can always talk to me. You can always talk to me. I guess you didn't say anything because you were scared. I hate to think that someday there'd be something you wouldn't want to tell me. So I'm glad you did, really. I know it's hard to hard. I don't know what I'm saying. It's hard to maintain like a friendship. Morning, and Fang. Team. Pretty day, right? Like, I can't believe this guy could be so hiding something hard. so bad. You know? Sorry, I've had a lot of coffee. I get free beans at Lava Java. I should stop talking. Yeah, you totally go into a caffeine fugue state. So, I'm basically her chaperone right now. Sure. Anything for a friend, right? I'm glad you're wired, Rosa. I barely slept last night. Mango keep you up with her chewing again? I've gotten used to that. <laughs> no, just life. Hey, did I tell you Dad's out of town again? Anyway, it's been a lot. Trish, been are studying you pretty... and practicing and momming. I know, but I think it's great you decide to stick it out to the battle. You kept saying you wanted to go out with a bang, and now you get to. Yeah, I guess so. Uh, yeah. The battle's gonna be great. But it's it's just the beginning. I mean, for worm drama. Yeah, totally. I know I'm leading for a while, but it's gonna be okay. Chop a worm in half and you get two worms. I mean, that's us. Two halves of the same worm just ringing along, doing our wormy things. It's gonna be totally fine. Hmm. Hey, uh, whatever happened to that person who was texting you? You mean Naomi? Oh, yeah, your mystery missives. Um, I don't think, uh, they're kind of great. I'm not ready to talk about it. Um, they're kind of great. Obviously, y'all put a heart emojis in the we text and everything. get along. It's kind of crazy wild. that it's Naomi. <laughs> Keep us posted. I'm so curious. I'll make sure. I better grab I'm my gonna, books. <laughs> I'm gonna try See to play later. this every day for uh because I didn't know there was eight episodes. So, I kinda thought you wanted to talk when you texted me. Yeah, I did. I do. Always. Everything's nuts right now, but I don't want that to mean we don't hang out. Right. Just you and me. And Rosa. Uh, Third room. Yeah, that was an accident. Rosa's really great, though. Promise. She likes you. She's cool. But, um, could we make some time for just the two of us, though? Heck yeah. Anytime you want. Well, not any anytime, but y you know what I mean. Okay. So, ritual tonight? Uh, yeah. I gotta babysit tonight. Right. Okay, what about uh, tomorrow? Maybe we can do it the day of the show? Um... I guess. I, I don't know I y'all do that. that. Work. I don't know you guys well, do that. See you tomorrow, I guess? <laughs> of course. See ya. Wow. It's 80 degrees. I hope my camera doesn't turn off. No, sir. I don't know, it's that hot today. Where do you go? I'm working late on the yearbook stuff with Naomi. Hey, Sib. I'm working oh. late on yearbook stuff with Naomi. Nice pick, by the way. There's some sesame noodles in the fridge for you. 
just heat them up with a little oil. Heat them up with a little oil? I don't do that. Do y'all do that? Instant noodle. Pretty hero. I'll be there tomorrow. Can't wait. We all know it's going to be an onion. It's going to be a quick, I'll dedicate that song to you. Oh my gosh. I know you'll be great. This is going to be so crazy. You work really hard for this. Why would Naomi just like text me and just, well, it must be hard. Hope it's okay that I'm coming. Of course. I really want to meet you. Am I being weird? No, no. I want it too. Oh. Oh. You gonna say it back? You gonna, you gonna put it back? Hello, pretty hero, Naomi? Uh, wink, wink. Like, I do like Faith's room. It's really nice. I wish I could make my room look like this. No harm. Uh, what about your sister? She's so cute. Um, let's put a heart. Oh, I was about to say, do I supposed to move something? Hey, mom and dad are calling. Right now? Oh, I yep. gotta see. Come I on. gotta see. <sighs> it's pretty hard for Faye, but it's okay. They're coming right now. On Zoom, they, uh, hello. Jackson, there you are. It's good to see you. Nasra said you've been working a lot. Is that why you look so tired? Miss you too, Mom. What a spy. Um, what a spy. What else did your spy say? Hey. We wouldn't have to have a spy if you would talk to us. Listen. Your mother and I have decided to come back tomorrow. That early? It's all this news about the meteor. Asteroid. What's the difference? Doesn't matter. Same impact. Very funny, Nasser. Dang. Hey, guess what Fang's doing tonight? What? What are you doing? Oh, oh. it's it's nothing. Their band made it into this huge music competition. Only a few acts made it this far, and it would be huge if they won. Like, career in music huge. Interesting. I never had a talent for music. I tried in college, you know? I remember. Unfortunately for me. <laughs> so, Must what? Have been you win money or something? Not exactly. Not exactly. It's not about money. Will they even get it? Let's keep this brief. They wouldn't get it. It's bigger than that. Winning basically means we made it, so... Mm-hmm. Who else will be there? Patricia? Well, she's in the band, so... Yeah. I like her. You should invite her for supper when we get back. Don't forget, hmm? I don't want to come home to a house that looks like a robbery happened. Fatma, you especially. Be good. You especially. Ha uh ha. -huh. Laugh it up, funny guy. Guess I shouldn't tell them I'm releasing a comedy album. Ha! <laughs> I don't think they'd survive. I've been a bad influence on you. Well, I guess the age of freedom has come to an end. Honestly, I was starting to miss them. Ugh. <sighs> You think you, they come back this tomorrow, the last so of the gear. they might come to my oh tonight. Never mind. Feels good. What? Well, uh, uh, I feel good. I feel good. I Let's hope I don't confident. jinx it, but yeah. You're gonna kill it. Like a bay. See you there. Changes the makeup yeah. every See look. Ya. Like, Wait. Seriously? Just one second. I wish I could put like. Huh? Eyeshadow and all you that, but I don't like makeup on lunch. 
More like an early dinner. Ah, me too much. Thanks, Dad. Thank you. Gotta have something in your stomach to puke out from all the nerves. Now, good luck. All right, it's time. I'm nervous. Hope I move the L stick up down. I press X. Yeah, I just had some coffee, well, so that's why. I... Yo. Hello, dearest lead singer. Oh, the music's so... lit. It's gonna be fine. I know. <laughs> I mean, no, I don't. We could completely bomb. It is gonna be fine. We should have practiced more. L let's go over the set list one more time. Faye, bro, dude, we got this. You got this. We're in, like, LJ likes us, and honestly, we rule. The hard part is over. It's time for the have fun and blow everyone's minds part. Which I'm personally excited about. <laughs> Remember when you booked us at that retirement place? Um, you mean the Shady Palms retirement community from which we are banned for life? <laughs> yeah. I still think that was one of our best shows. Oh, yeah, it was. Lucky nobody died. See? We've been touching people's lives with our music for years. Just think, when we started, you and I were basically the same height. Now look at us. <laughs> we're like actual complete people now. <laughs> Speak for yourself. I can play way more than four bar chords. I can play all the chords. And you, you've become like this musical wizard. Dark mage. And you are also here. Yep. Seriously. <laughs> you guys are in all my best memories. No. Oh. Yeah, I know. Man, it's really happening. Yeah. It's the After end this, of the I'm gonna have to uh, take out dinner. Tonight's gonna kick ass. I'm looking to have this with you. It doesn't need to be the end. Oh, we're gonna go crazy tonight. Hey, we've still got one more worm drama memory to make. Yeah, we do. I gotta, uh, defrost some chicken. Defrost some chicken. I'm gonna go record one video. I did want to do, uh, Princess Peach, but I think I'll record it tonight. And then, uh, my main channel videos tonight. So if I try to Whoa. record this every day, you guys have, like, feel extremely a video. Cool and capable. Mm, yep. Ooh, this is legit. Never seen so many bards in one place before. We got this, y'all. Hey, rock stars. Is this wild or what? I finally get I to see Worm Drama in its here. natural habitat. Even got some VIPs waiting for a meet and greet before sound check. Okay, pressure's on. Thank you for coming, you guys. Please, please, no autographs. Too bad, I'm gonna need one. I'm Don't worry, you guys about on. this. Seriously. First of all, you look incredible. Blush Second back. of all, I think they picked the winner based on how loud the audience is. Let's actually see that. Um, okay, so new girl. Oh. I forgot Fang looks like Lisa looked like this. I don't know if I really like the red hair. So there I was, covered head to toe in. Oh. Group, I bring a person. Okay. That is a person. Her name is Stella and she is new and also my best friend. A lot is happening right now. Hi, uh, everyone. I just moved here from Cliffside. So that's Trish, Reed, Fang. Hey. Yo, hey, and I'm Sage. I know, hun. Nice to meet you. I play music and our journey very cool. Some of us are cooler than others. Hey, so what are you into? Well, what do you know about star charts? I'm a Jimmy, Jimmy Don. I don't know what that is. I know, hun. I like her. 
besties let's do crimes what is going on yeah that, they're really besties for sure uh there's people on tw is this instagram or th th this is twitter don't read these i need to read these and right, i drink hot tea all day so i can here. cheer extra loud all night seriously we've been scoping out the competition and you really don't have anything to worry about well <laughs> crisis averted i believe in you there's a ton of bands here but none of them are the worm drama <laughs> thanks Gotta support my words. Thanks for for oh god, pushes on since when? Since when are her words? Hey, you got Thanks. any plans this summer? We're gonna need a tour manager. Sign me up. Wanna draw a card? See how it'll go. Can you guarantee a good omen? No, no, can't do. I promised a witch I wouldn't touch tarot cards for five more years. Okay. Then you're up, Fang. For a huge moment, why not? Can't hurt, I guess. Oh, which one did I pick last time? The middle? I'm gonna do the end. Oh my gosh! Well, I... this happens, but it's actually wow. good, right? That's what you were gonna say. Please. <laughs> well, kinda. I mean, something is definitely going to die or end. We're gonna murder the swamp babies! Why did I skip <laughs> all that? Uh, time for a bloodbath. We were born for this, Trish. Vanquish our enemies. I mean, it all sounds like whatever happens, you'll be okay with it. 100%. I get how it seems scary, but the card is really talking about how ready you are for something good. Oh, hey! <gasps> Naomi's here. You think she's okay? She's giving off a lot of worried librarian energy right now. Naomi! She'll be fine. We've got to go. See y'all from the stage, baby! Oh, oh does Faye know? Drama. Does Faye know? I keep calling, I keep calling uh, Faye Faye. Because that's their, um, their worship of color. Oh, I think Faye knows. Look at them. Seriously, why are they so popular? I hate to say it. But they don't they look know that way. Fang, it's true. They're like technically good. I mean, not We're gonna good, be better. good, but you know, catchy hooks, watered down alt boy aesthetic. People eat that shit up. Are we next? Oh shit! Oh shit! It's happening! E of the bees. It's drama clock. Whoa! Uh, uh, why are my fingers so slippery? Wait. What's a guitar? <laughs> what is music, really? When you stop to think about it. I love these idiots. At least LJ isn't here. I love them. <laughs> I love you guys. Oh, shit! Wait, what's happening? LJ? Worm drama, right? That's right. Want to fight about it? Uh, not really. D anyway, yeah, nice. My little cousin said your posters were up all over the high school. It's awesome that LJ lets kids compete. Who's your cousin? Kids? Oh. Teens? teens? We are, in fact, teens, Trish. You're Fang? Um, yes. LJ says you have a pretty sick voice. You've been playing around with something like really different for backup vocals on our new stuff can you look at me and not the phone maybe you should come down to the studio sometime whoa be good exposure you know exposure <laughs> we're good thanks yeah super good well <laughs> think about it we had eighty thousand lessons last month probably gonna tour again soon oh and hey Looks like we're on right before you. Good luck out there. Yeah, you have fun. Oh, I hope we too. don't mess up. Those dudes truly suck. You 
trash. Could be good for trash. <laughs> Buzz off, dick. Yeah, gross. Now we have to win. Even harder than we were already going to. Cheers to that. Yeah, yeah. No, you're right. We're gonna win and we're gonna play Caldera Fest. And we're gonna get like a billion listens. Take that, Trant. Let's see how they go. I want to hear their music. Hey, hey. Hey, yourself. A lot of people out there. A lot of future worm drama fans. Or a lot of booers. Booing ones. Ones, ones that boo. This doesn't seem like a booing type crowd. It says Mr. Never Been Booed. You've seen my speeches. I have definitely been booed. Okay, me booing you does not count. Oh my god. We gotta stop saying boo. Listen, you're, right. <laughs> you're going to be great. All three of you are. You're only here because you've kept going every step of the way, no matter what. It's no different here. Trust me, once you're up there, it's going to hit you. This is your moment. The first of many your moments. Time to face the music. Oh, you got so far, too. Gotta be me. Remember when you taught me piano chords? Wow, I forgot all about that. I think about it a lot. Teach these assholes a thing or two. All right, we got this. Bruh. Let's continue. Obviously, they're doing great. We, we can't hear it. Just look at pictures. Perfect, obviously. They ain't doing that crazy. Never mind. That means it kind of bopping. Okay, this is it. We can do this together. I got a trophy. Unlock all flashbacks? Really? I was not expecting to get a trophy and for that. Meeting. Huh? Now? Yeah. I just want to say. Best friends, best band. I'm gonna look I'm at that flashback in, in a world. minute. Who? Us? Definitely. What's going on? The power went out. Are you serious? Oh god. Do you think it's the meteor? Probably. But this place uh, is like also like a million. Five years episodes old. four hey, episodes can I get away. Some power from that. To my amp over here? Three episodes I away. I kind of feel bad for them. And they back, they go right back in it. I understand, you know, me there about to, you know, struck at us in a minute, any miss, any second, episode eight. <laughs> I like how Faye is the only one that changed. Everybody else wearing the same outfit. And we're up. You good? Let's go. I'm good. Let's go. You're good. We are good. We're good. We got this. Are you kidding me? That meteor is really messing stuff up. Let's look at this flashback. Reed has a crush. Let's see this foot. It's gonna be a low-key long part, y'all. Show me a pic. God, this is why I don't like to tell you things. First of all, you do tell me things. Second of all, show me a pic. Ooh. Absolutely not, and there's nothing anyway. Hello, fellow drama, drama Turks. Oh? What, uh, Reed said you are cute. You are what a winky face to a person. Who? It was like, you're, like, you're. Oh, come on now, let's see. Reed, have you, like, ever flirted before? I have you know, I am very well liked. Alvin? Wait, what? Scroll up, scroll up, scroll up. Alvin? Have... Oh, she's pretty. This is like read fan fiction. This is even better than my read fan fiction. Please kill me. Oh wow. 
So are we gonna Oh, this is not good. Fuck it. We gotta go we gotta do it in the way? Dang it's Dang it's better than me. I would have dipped. Are y'all coming to support at least? Oh Oh my god. Took my time getting over down. Got to hold it. Fail. Make my mind up. No more doubt. I have to hold it the whole time. At twelve o'clock, I'll write a manifesto. It's a way. Oh, and Naomi. Maybe they will find my bones and make. I'm not afraid to die. I'm not afraid to go away. It's just the blinking of an eye, the culmination of today. Almost. Choke. Let's go, Fang. I don't even need reading. No, I need my friends. Woo! Don't know how I did that. So, it wasn't perfect, but I did it. I thought I had to just flick it, but I didn't know I had to hold it. I just missed a lot of notes over there. Come on, y'all scream. Get over 90%. Oh, wow. I didn't know that was a trophy. I could have eased. Thank goodness I got that trophy. I would have restarted this whole episode for that. Come on. I could have got 25%. I should have got 100. Oh, now the second song. Let's go. Ah, oh, this is the picture I saw like when I open when I'm like hovering through the game. That little shot there. I like these type of music. It reminds me of like Life is Strange a little bit. Yeah, 
I missed that. I like this song. I really like this song. my gosh that was very difficult and i got the trophy let's go i hardly need to say anything do i i give you our winners of the battle of the bands worm drama let's go let's go yo let's go let's go that was great music i loved both of the songs that's oh my god. Oh my god, we oh won. My god. Oh my we god. Won. Let's go. Obliterated it. It was so dramatic and cool and powerful and yes! And bang. It was like bang. Holy shit, dude. You pulled up a solo, bang at a in solo the dark. And the that was dark. amazing. Really amazing. Classic dark one. Thanks, guys. God, if we did that well in a power outage, imagine how we're gonna do on tour. We're gonna crush it even oh, better right about that bang i need to tell you something kind of important yeah what's up sorry i had to i wanted to talk to you text. about touring this summer i just so you know how a while back i said i wanted to go on a break from worm drama yeah our champions congrats on a killer performance oh. kids you blew everyone away in the dark no less anyway as you know winners of the battle go to caldera fest but I wanted to come and personally confirm it. You in? Yes, yes. We are so in. Glad to hear it. I'll let you celebrate. Great show. Sorry, Trish. Continue. Continue. Um, Continue. Did I miss something? Everything okay? Uh, did I miss something? Did I miss something? Obviously, are you did. You celebrating? Yes. Totally. We are celebrating. What is going Dude, on? Th that was amazing, right? Bang? I'm happy for you. Really. For us. But I don't think we're on the same page about Caldera Fest. What do you mean? Trish, not going. This is what we've always wanted. We finally proved ourselves to LJ, to everyone. We're doing it. What? What is it? This is our chance to do what we love. That's what you love, Fang. You never asked what we wanted. Oh, gosh. You never told me. What is else? You never told me. Well, actually, F Trish did. Okay, then tell me. What is it that you want? I shouldn't have to tell you, Fang. I know you want Is it too much to expect you to ask? To even care? I do care. Then why have you never noticed what I wanted? How long have you felt like this? Oh God, Trish, Bessie's fight. I, how long have you felt like this? Does it even matter at this point? Fang, you refuse to see anything you don't want. <laughs> That's oh. not true. <laughs> Isn't it though? At least I'm upfront about what I want. This whole time, you still haven't told me anything. What do you even want? I have other friends, Fang. If all I do is rehearse for what you want, I won't have any time to see them. <laughs> you mean one other friend. Oh. Oh. I know Caldera Fest means a lot to you. And I don't want to take that away from you. I just need time of my own. Maybe we 
could do Caldera fast as a I knew solo. it. I'm gonna have to do a solo. What? Even you Reed's totally going? You pull it off. And LJ's obviously in your corner now, so... No way. This is crazy. How could you even suggest that? Um, hello? You killed it on stage before Reed and I joined you. Obviously, you got the skills. You don't really need us up there with you. The only reason I was able to do all of that was because I knew that you and Reed were gonna pack me up. You have always had my back. Why are you leaving right when it matters the most? Okay, come on, let... When have you ever had my back, Faye? Oh We've my gosh. We've always done what you wanted to do, and that's fine. Oh my but gosh. There's only so much time we have left. I can't spend the rest of it following along after you. I need to think of myself, too. Oh. But that is true. You gotta follow your own dream path. Okay. It's oh, this is way too much. It I didn't know what, there were so many choices. There were so many choices. I couldn't even say either. I, I didn't even get to say what I chose. On X. Read. So I guess this is a solo thing. Trish got other friends. You know, Trish wanna do a uh, bug college stuff and it's kinda messed up. I guess, you know, I guess it's right. Fang has been only worried about the Bang! band and all the stuff. I don't think I should go over there. Hey, superstar! Oh, too bright. Oh, my eyes. Someone get the power again. Thane, you guys were amazing. For real. Chills. Ah, it was magical. Oh, by the way, I saw Trish and Reed pop out earlier. Ah, I can't believe they ditched their biggest fans in their hour of triumph. You must have known you were going to make them sign your face. Fang! You blew everyone away. Me include, obviously. Can I congratulate you in person? I'm outside. Oh my gosh. Let's do it. Let's do it. No reason for me to stay, right? Um, I'm sorry. I, I just remembered I had plans to go meet someone after the show. Uh, plans? To meet someone? My mysterious person. It's not like that. It's not like that. Oh my god, it's it's not like that. Not In like that, case, that. Just to help you prepare. Even though it oh, is. Hook it off, you two. Anyway, if you see Trish and Reed, tell them there are faces to be signed here. Yeah, sure. Uh, will do. I'll catch you guys later. Naomi, we already know. It's Naomi. Oh, hey Naomi. I, I was just looking for somebody. Yeah, I, I know. <laughs> uh, thanks for meeting me. <laughs> wait, wait, you're the. Yep. Yeah, it, it's me. Surprise. And she's wearing the shirt. She's wearing the shirt. Um, anyway, you guys were amazing. I mean, I knew you were good, but tonight was something special. Oh, thanks. It was fun. This is pretty I awkward. Mean, it was more than fun, I hope. You've been waiting for this for so long. It was incredible. Fang, are you okay? I... a lot happened. After the show. Like, a lot. With Trish and Reed. Honestly. I can't deal with this. I don't think I can deal with this right now. It's not, it's not you. I swear. I just, stuff went really, really badly with the band. And it's all I can think about. Sorry. It's fine. Can we talk Oof. about it later, maybe? Sure. We can talk later. Naomi, I... It's fine. I'm used to waiting for you. Oh! Dang. Dang.
And that's how we're gonna pause it like that. So I, I, I've been recording for an hour and 17 minutes, y'all. This could be a long video. So we're gonna stop it here, y'all. Crazy. I knew it was Naomi. It just gave up the vibes a little bit. A little bit. The way how Naomi always say we're cool and she like kind of like us and like saying that she just, she just like everything about Fang or something. Like she's always very supportive when Fang is saying something like, you know, whenever Fang is near. She gets kind of like nervous and you know all that so and it's kind of sad that Fang after you know if the whole thing with the battle of the bands with Reed and uh Trish I think Fang would have you know handled that meeting a lot better it would have been a lot like I guess I don't know maybe Fang would be surprised but at the same time maybe be happy but now Naomi has to wait for a little longer like, it's crazy that she said that she is used to waiting for things. But anyways, y'all, thank y'all so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. And, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, you guys. Time to jump up in the air.